Amputation bags? Oh, really? What? Oh, I feel like what are they? Your half of putting your finger in it? Finger. <laughs> We're going to be doing a review, aren't we? A little camp. Yeah. We'll camp review of the <laughs> modular survival first aid kit from BCF. The one thing I don't like about those, it doesn't have Velcro on the back. Yeah. That's annoying because I've been trying to figure out how to mount it to places. This looks intense, man. I know. It's, I don't even know what's in the half. What have you got things. here? So we're going to have a look. Should we open up one at a time? Or? Yeah. Okay. One at a time. Right, which one did you want to pick? Let's start with the top. Oh. Let's go cuts and wounds. Cuts and wounds. We've used that one a couple yeah. of times today, even. See, I, cut, like, I, like cut the to the, I like the Velcro. Yeah, the, the, see, the Velcro is on the inside, but we've been yeah. handy on, on the outside on the bottom. We've used this a couple of times today, haven't we? <laughs> oh, maybe. Jeez, maybe. <laughs> cut to the video of me with blood all over me. All right, what do we got? A lot of packaging. Yeah, I reckon. You know, like... Are you going to have to undo all yeah. the packaging? <laughs> you wouldn't want to be in a rush. I mean, if, if someone's dying, you know. So it's like, oh, just give me one second. I've got to find scissors. <laughs> like, mm, using your teeth to get yeah. into it. Yeah. So what? So what? We've got a we got we've got a ten centimeter heavy crate bandage. Sounds right. delicious. Yeah. A conforming bandage. Like, let's face it. All we would do is just unwrap one. Yeah. And just stick it in the wound. Right, that's that pretty one? much all we'd do. This, this one's a smaller version of that one. All right. Small. Things fall down trees. Conforming bandage. Mm. Yeah. So this is our not band aid. Clearly, it says adhesive first aid plaster, and is it that one's a fabric yeah, one. Yeah, that one's good. Ones. good. Yeah, this one's this one's stuck before. Yeah, and the plastic ones are rubbish. Mm. So I might swap them out. Yeah, different plastic ones. adhesive plasters. Oh, there's actually a little list in each of these. What's in them? So I guess you can replace oh. them as you go. But you know, who needs that? We don't <laughs> need instructions. A, bit of a spin of stock take. Yeah. End of financial year. Yeah. So we got a what's that? My plastic. Oh, that's paper, tape. paper yeah. tape. I guess. I don't know how how strong that stuff is, eh? Yeah. I mean, I would just be using electrical tape. Yeah. Amputation bags? Oh, really? What? Oh, for like. What are they? Your finger. Oh, for putting your finger in it. Your finger. <laughs> this is carefully I wonder placed. how big they are. The amputated part inside a suitably sized bag and seal. <laughs> After use, place the, the amputation no bag way. in a clinical waste bag and dispose of thoughtfully. <laughs> one large, one medium, one small. What do you fit your leg in one of those? I don't know. That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> we should try that. Oh, no. For suitable for small amputated parts. Small amputated <laughs> So, leg, probably not. <laughs> amputation bags. Yeah, that was a shock. Yeah. And gloves. Oh, that's yeah. That's good. Oh, I disposable. In the cuts and wounds one. Yeah. Wound closure strips. I suppose they're all packaged separately to keep them sort of... Oh, it makes sense. Separate, hey. So what's this? We've got two packets of wound closure strips. I like those ones, like if you get a cut above your eye, yeah. it like pulls it shut. Oh, yeah. Um, and non-adherent dressing. So that's good. Yeah. Uh, and, a, and a combine dressing. So I guess for big areas. Yeah. That's pretty much it. That's the purple one. That's a cuts and wounds that's, one. Uh... That's pretty intense. Yeah, man. Jeez. I guess that's the one you probably, I guess, use the most. Like, I yeah. got that trauma kit in my car. Maybe that's it. It's kind of similar. That's I'm going to put that at the top, though. Cause, like, yeah, we, we use... might need that again. But yeah. Um, probably <laughs> sooner rather than later. The invitation bags down the bottom. Yeah, probably won't, won't be using them. Use them at all. Take them away. Yeah. All right. And for these, oh, you know, it's never going to go back the way nah. that it came out, did it? Oh, Let's that's, see. Not right. that's not too bad, actually. Yeah. I'll edit these parts out, probably. Yeah. All right. Did you want to do the honors for the burns and scalds? Yeah. Let's have a look at that. Here you go. Burn. See what, what do we have here? So sunburn, scald, thermal burns, other minor burns. I got I got a good one for sunburn. I uh, don't get it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ooh, wow, oh, that's yeah. interesting. Refill kit. This is cool. Uh, aloe vera. Oh. Spray. Mm. Natural oh, yeah. too. Relieve burn gel. Mm. That's cool. More mm. tape. Mm. In case. Yeah. Ah. Uh, yeah. I suppose you know. Mm. 
another conforming bandage. So, very similar. I guess, yeah, I guess for a burn. Oh, this is one of those. Oh, a burn gel. Oh. That must be for, like, real serious ones, So it must eh? be that stuff and that stuff. Yeah, I mean, that might be just for minor stuff. Yeah. Cooling gel for burns. There's a fair bit in there, too, eh? Hmm. <clears throat> Right here. Oh, there's like more little relief mm. burn gels. Oh, good. Little, little small ones. That's good because you don't want to open up the massive yeah, one. Yeah, unless you like, waste you know, it all. Third degree burns. Yeah. Gloves again. Oh, yeah. Disposable gloves. Well, it's good they kind of have that in every kit. You yeah. can pretty much just take it with you, can't you? Yeah, and then non adhesive dressings. Mm. So that's probably put over there. Uh, a big one. 20 by 10. Jeez. Yeah. That'd be like just you burn your arm the or something. Moderate wounds only. Yeah. Oh, I wouldn't want to be serious then. No. <laughs> well, this one's though. For moderate wounds only as well. <laughs> Whoops. Oh well. Well, don't burn yourself seriously, guys. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Secure the end with first aid tape. Must be the first aid. Oh tape, yeah, it? yeah. Okay. That's pretty um. Pretty straightforward that one, isn't it? Yeah. I like how they have instructions on all yeah. the things. It's not a bad idea. Lots of, you know. Burn gels, tape. Mm. Aloe vera, that's a good idea. Yeah. If you get sunburnt. Yeah. And then, yeah, just your refill kit. Yeah. Yeah. That's cool. Good luck fitting it all back in there. <laughs> that, they actually seem to fit back in. Yeah. Just... I keep saying that, but they always keep going <laughs> back in. Alright. Cool. There you go. Nice. Very nice. Burn school kit. Mm. All right. Let's see what else we got. Oh, oh this one's yeah. this one's massive. This yeah. one prepared for first aid essentials, CPR, shock, trauma. Oh, uh, okay. Other first aid emergencies. So this well, this is this will be a good one to know what's actually in. Yeah. In it. This one's a go-to. Oh, oh, what in this like one? Like bulging. <laughs> so I think this one's eye wash one. Oh, yeah. Or is it that's eye so, wash? Eye wash. Yeah. It's just basically a little bit of salt water, I think. Sodium chloride. It's like the, like the saline water. stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess if you got something really bad in your eye, yeah. trying to flush it out. Um, yeah. Are these the same thing? I think they are. Are they like... Um, I think they might be... Ones... I think they're like diggers. They yeah. like dig stuff out of you. Yeah. What do you call them? Come on back. I think they... Do they have a name? Disposable splinter probes. Mm, okay. <laughs> Well, that's what my knife is for. Probing for splinters. Yeah. Hmm, great. <laughs> yeah. That's what you want to do. Yeah. You're like, oh, now I got it stuck in my leg now. <laughs> <laughs> I got it stuck in my foot. Yeah. Cotton triangular bandage. I'm trying to think what that would be for. Shock trauma. Tra oh, oh, maybe. maybe for, or, yeah, yeah, broken yeah, arm. Broken something arm. Like that. Yeah. Let's just maybe support it. Yeah. First yeah. aid spray. Oh, just an antiseptic spray. Oh, yeah. That's pretty cool. CPR mask. Yeah. That was that one's got like the little um, um, valve on yeah. it. That's better than the other ones, yeah. I reckon. Uh, and then yeah, just some more conforming bandages. Yeah. Like that one. And wound wipes. Oh, so yeah, probably just more. Free. Yeah. So probably just more antiseptic stuff. Yeah. iPad. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Classic. And yeah. gauze swabs. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Hmm. I don't know. I guess that's like um, if you have like car accidents or something, or gravel rash yeah. maybe. Use oh heavy, yeah. Heavy duty stuff. Heavy duty scissors. Yeah. That's Cut like, off jeans and yeah, that. Yeah, shirts. And oh, stuff. those are good tweezers. Oh yeah. That's good. That'd be handy for those leeches we had today. Yeah. Get them off. And safety pins. I like how they're in there. Not like, like the safety pins. Yeah. Yeah, and they're not just chucked in. They're in kind like a of little bag. They're not... Yeah, and they're all made by the same company. Which is pretty interesting. Different like sizes, the first aid people. Same sizes. Um, they look like they're different sizes. Mm. Yeah. They Fair go enough. big to small. Yeah. That's pretty smart. Hmm. Yeah. Very anyway, so that's that one. So I guess that one's just like your road trauma kit. Yeah. It looks like. That's it. Not too heavy bleeding though. Cause it doesn't no. have tourniquets and stuff, but. A few bandages. Yeah. You know, that's like maybe, I don't know. Just gravel rash that sort of yeah. stuff getting stuff in your eyes CPR. a little bit of a, an assorted lot isn't it that one yeah a bit of eye wash bit of this bit of that antiseptic stuff too Splint, that's good to know splinter probes good to know there's a lot in this one though yeah here we yeah. go we'll test we'll, we'll <laughs> test if we can actually get this back or not so first aid stuff's already falling out 
I don't know when yeah. it comes to all these categories, hey? Yeah, I don't know. I like how like, they've got everything in there that yeah. you need. I mean, like, I mean, if you're going on a hike, it makes sense that you would take just one of these, yeah. you know? Like, you wouldn't take, you wouldn't have to take the whole pack. Yeah, this is definitely going to be an off-camera job, this one. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah. Just crammed all down. Probably break the zip. <laughs> oh, the case is Oh, here we go. Yeah, the cases are pretty, they're pretty rugged though. Yeah, eh? they're pretty sturdy. Looking. Yeah. All right, um, All right. So we've got SOS and remote, bites and stings, and outdoor prevention. What do you reckon? The outdoor prevention. Yeah. I want to save the SOS and remote yeah. for last. There's not much in that one. All, All right. right. This one here. So sunburn prevention, germ prevention, insect mm. prevention. This one seems pretty light. Yeah. Doesn't like a lot in here. Oh. There's something in the oh, thing grabbing. Oh, very light this one. Wow. Bit of hand sunny, carabiner. <laughs> what is it with them Cut putting stuff on carabiners? Yeah. It's like, like repellent. Plastic. Oh, yeah, that would have been handy. Yeah. To find a better place for this. Cotton tips. Yep. Always looking for them. And a sort of first aid wound wipes. So, what's what's that kit called Prevention. again? Wound wipes. Oh, I guess like if you. Oh, yeah. Antibacterial, yeah. so they get infected. So, so sunburn prevention. Germ prevention. Yeah. Insect. Oh, sorry. Okay. Yeah. Sunburn prevention? No sunscreen. Yeah, you would think that would be in there. Hmm. Doesn't seem... No, I mean, that's... that's kind it. of like that's... one of the three things that they have. So yeah. they've got germs. Germ prevention. Germs still. That's, yeah, that's the insect. Why would they have cotton tips in there? To apply... <laughs> to apply... To apply the hand sanitizer yeah. to you. That's a weird one, that one. Sure. Yeah. I reckon a little, a little bottle of um, sunscreen. Yeah, sunscreen. Yeah, in there, I, I mean, think. it says I might sun, put some in there. Sunburn prevention. So like, that's not gonna, yeah, that's not stopping you sunburn, is nah. it? Anyway, unless they know something we don't. Yeah, maybe they like oh, try it. insect repellent actually, <laughs> actually prevents yeah. sunburn. That one's very basic. That one. Yeah, not too impressed with that one. No, might, that's it. Might look at something. Might mm. look at putting some, but um. Sunscreen in there. Yeah. All right, here we go. We've Snakes. got bites and stings now. This will be interesting. I reckon there's going to be lots of triangular bandages mm. in this one. Hopefully, Ooh. anyway. Oh, it's got like a little thing. It's got a treatment guide in oh, here right. too. I think it's got one in every single one. It's pretty cool. Nice. I mean, you're not really just like, oh, oh, just one second, yeah. mate. I'm just going to have a look <laughs> and see how to treat a red belly <laughs> situation or a taipan. Um, so that one's just a bandage. So yeah. you would like use that to compress a bit, yeah. I suppose. A tick remover. That's oh, is that what it is? That's an interesting one, actually. I was um, I was ah. I was talking um, I was talking earlier about uh, this was like a you know like ages ago last year yeah. about how having a first aid kit is good to have if you have a dog, yeah. Because like, if you go out, you know, with your dog like hunting or whatever, yeah. or you're just going out camping, and you don't have first aid kit, first aid kits can also be for your dogs. So if they have, I've a tick, never seen one in before. I know. Here, have a look at that. That's crazy. <laughs> A tiny magnifying glass too. I've never seen one there. Yeah. I've That's... seen something similar, like in the vets and that. But yeah. Well, you know, you want to pull the head out as well. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. That's not. That's not bad actually. Yeah. That's I pretty like good. That. A little tiny magnifying oh, yeah. glass, I guess, for the case, tick or whatever. Can't more gloves. Yeah. It's good that they include that in the relevant ones. Uh, more wound wipes. Yeah. Um, oh, yeah. Sting relief prep pad. I can't get some bugs on me. Yeah. Might need the insect. Yeah, kit. I get the, <laughs> the intervention <laughs> um, kit. After bite, the itch eraser. Okay. Says original. It doesn't look like it's the first aid company one either. So that's an interesting one. It's like a pen, is it? Yeah. Take off the lid and have a look. Um, should be a maybe a roller, do you think? Oh, yeah. Oh, it's, it's like, like a, a stick. Like a chapstick. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah. You get your, maybe rub it on yourself, maybe. Yeah, yeah. Like, like an eraser, as the name suggests. Ah, hmm. <laughs> you know what? Probably makes a lot. It <laughs> yeah. checks out. Yeah. Cotton triangular bandage. There oh, you go. Yeah. That's kind of an obvious oh, one. Those instant cold pack oh, things. That cool. Instant has... cold packs. Squeeze together here. Yeah, nice. That's cool. That'd be awesome. Is it just like gel, is it? Or yeah, is yeah. It? Have a feel. It's kind of like... um. It's kind of like, uh, I don't know, it kind of feels crunkly. Yeah. I guess the gel crystals or something get activated. Yeah. 
That, that's a good idea, hey? Yeah. Your magnifying glass works. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty good, actually. Yeah, instant cold pack. Yeah, that's that's cool. Could be handy. Yeah, sure. But like, I guess if you have a family as well, like kids, you know, they always like run through the scrub and that. Yeah. So, you know, I yeah. guess it kind of makes sense. No, nothing fits sideways, <laughs> by the way. If you ever buy this kit, trying to put it back. No, don't even try uh, it. Don't, don't even try it. All right. I think you've got the honors of doing the last, last one, one, my friend. Mm, this would be good. Yep. Looks pretty, looks pretty bulky. SOS and remote. Yeah. I mean, well, that's probably the most practical one, yeah. isn't it? Like... You know, you're going hiking or whatever. Yeah. And it says camping on it too, I think. Yeah, well. nice. It says remote areas. As we are right now. Remote areas, hiking, adventure, camping. Yeah, feels pretty heavy. Mm. It's, uh, cool. Oh, this is the duct tape one. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's so poncho. All the weights in the, in the poncho. One size fits all adult poncho. It's not really one size all, <laughs> yeah. you know. I look ah. so happy. Check this out. Duct tape. Yeah. And a whistle like a compass. On the side. A whistle and a compass. On the side. Does the compass work? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Not twisted around. Yeah. <laughs> that's cool. I've never seen that before. Yeah, that's awesome. And it's and oh. it's camouflage, so you'll lose it easily. Accident report notebook. Always useful. <laughs> or uh, emergency journal <laughs> if you're a journaler. Yeah. There's the torch and the carabiner. Hey, this one's this this pack is the best one. And these are those I want to try this. Emergency blankets. They're, oh, these, yeah, they're cool. They're good. I think there's like three in there. I think. Really? Maybe. Oh no, just this blanket. Maybe one. Uh, it'll be a big one though. Let's yeah. see if this works. Maybe you have to put batteries in it. You twist it. Twist it off. Yeah. I don't know. Turn it all back down. Yeah. Maybe it was. Oh, hang on. There's a piece of plastic in here. Oh yeah. You think it, it'd work as straight? Oh, away. don't you love it trying to find the thread? And yeah. Like you keep going. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yeah. Just turn off the light. Yeah. Yeah. How do you turn this in here? Yeah. Get a little. Oh, hey, yeah. it's pretty bright. Yeah, look at that. It's a little LED. That's pretty good. Yeah. I mean, if you. Jeez. Yeah. I mean. If you I, get more light. Shine, well, it shines up to the top of the trees. Yeah. And that's with our eyes not adjusted. Hey, that's not bad. Hey, that's pretty good. Very cool. Hey. This one, oh, yeah. this one's good. I like this one. It's like something you buy at like, you know, for a dollar Oh, yeah, for it? sure. Yeah, it's, you know? it's your classic yeah. look at these people. just like, oh, yeah. I'm so happy, <laughs> you know. It's like, wow. And the notebook. Wow. And the accident report notebook. I Oh, you know what? I reckon that would be aimed squarely at the people that would be... That would be, you know, work sites and stuff. Yeah. You know, like and if you're on a work site, yeah. yeah. If you're on a work site, something happens. Or farms. Yeah. Remember on Jeremy's farm? Yeah. Now every accident they have, they have like an accident book. Under record, yeah, yeah. That's right, yeah. So it kind of checks out. Yeah. Makes sense. That's pretty cool. Well, I, I just almost... spotted one more thing on this whistle. Check yeah. this out. Now, this, it's got the compass on the one side, yeah. like you said, and the whistle, and it's got um, a thermometer. Oh, really? Yeah, look at it. Oh yeah, right now it says about uh, about twenty degrees. That'd be about right, wouldn't it? Jeez, yeah, that's pretty accurate. <laughs> that's weird. That's, that's very cool. I don't know yeah. how do they manage doing yeah. that? Yeah, that's pretty clever. Anyway, yeah. But yeah, I guess that pretty much wraps it up, doesn't it? The duct tape is a bit. Yeah. I guess survival. <laughs> I guess you can use duct tape for anything, I mean, can't you? Yeah. Yeah, but in terms anyway. of body parts, maybe not like. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's not really first aid, <laughs> is it? It's more like, you know, maybe making shelter. Yeah, that's the only thing I can think of. Yes, and the poncho, the ponchos. Oh, I don't know why the poncho is so big. Like you can yeah. get ponchos that are like half the size. Yeah. Man, that's the biggest Photoshop image. Too. Oh my! <laughs> the bubbles in the back. Why yeah. though? Yeah, it's, like, it's not rain. <laughs> it's like excellent, uh, yeah. specifically designed for bubble <laughs> fights or something for birthday parties. Oh, this isn't gonna go. No, no, that might be an off-camera job. That mm. one. Oh, yeah. Ah, well, we've said that before. Yeah. Who knows? It's <laughs> look at the duct tape. It's so ridiculous. Oh, it's gonna go that way. Yeah, that way. Yeah. Oh, I don't yeah. know. Uh, and now we got that in the first time. Only one zip too. Yeah. Oh, two zips would have been better. Yeah. Eh? Especially if they're cramming that much stuff in there. I, re 
Does that need to be followed? Oh, so the battery ran out, but anyway, right. we'll, we'll just pick up where we left off. Yeah. But yeah, we're just saying that it was, you know, pretty pretty handy. And yeah. I guess just looking at the, the symbols, the symbols made the most sense. Yeah. Um, but yeah, but we're a little bit disappointed. I think we said that before anyway. Yeah. Just with the... That very light, that one, isn't it? Like, it's yeah. empty. Yeah, oh, I'll shine that right in your eye, sorry. Yeah, yeah. Empty, isn't it? But... Yeah, sunburn prevention one wasn't very good. Wasn't mm. very good, so might I might just chuck a little thing of sunscreen, maybe. Sunscreen in yeah, there. yeah, that might be best. Yeah, but yeah, I mean, like for everything that you need, yeah, I, mean, I can't, I can't really find too much oh, else wrong with it. I don't it. know what else you add to it. I mean, you've done quite a bit of outdoor ed stuff, yeah, and, and you know, yeah. done some camping as well, just organizing camps with kids and stuff yeah. too. So you know, I guess if you're going to take something like this, is probably everything that you need, really. Yeah. Um, the only thing you just need to add is probably just things like like specific first aid stuff. Like yeah. A kid has asthma or something. Yeah, else. Panadol maybe. Or yeah. EpiPen yeah. Or... Actually, that's really good. Yeah. yeah. EpiPen or... Yeah. Just even keeping one of those handy yeah. would be good um, just yeah. in case. You never know when... Yeah. 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 Those, um, those EpiPens would be good. Yeah. It'd be good to keep one in here because like even right now we're at a campsite and there's like what probably mm. another five or six camps yeah. here and they all have a few people with them so you never know when you might need it like i always think that when we carry first aid kits it's not for ourselves it's more like for for other people as well people we can't with or whatever so it kind of makes sense that mm. you would that you would um prepare for that as well but for a general kit like yeah. i just keep this in the back of the car and just you know grab it and go yeah done it's got everything you need in it yeah and I guess it's good as well having everyone at the camp knowing, yeah, knowing who like what's in it and where it is as well. So might be good to just sit down at some point, yeah, as well. People in your camp. But if anyway, if anyone's looking to purchase this, it's at BCF, um, and it's made by First Aid. Oh, hmm. oh, really? Really <laughs> smart, smart branding there. Yeah. Really smart. So yeah. yeah, and it's the modular survival first aid kit. So and yeah, I thought it was pretty good. It, I wouldn't go out and buy another first aid kit now that I have this. Mm. You know, those those big um those big green ones. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they take up a lot of room too. This one's this one's good cuz it sits flat. Pretty um soft. Yeah, it yeah. sits flat in the probably not the same video but my um packing video where I packed up for this camp. It just sits on top of all my stuff and I can just wedge it between places as well fits underneath yeah. the front car seat too. And just grab it by the handle, pull it out. But yeah, no, I thought it was pretty good. Anyway, yeah, good all stuff. Right. Well, uh, we've got to get back to camping. So, yeah. yep. All right. Have a good one, everyone. See ya.